Hey guys, and welcome back to more Siphon Filter. When we last left off, we were trying to stop terrorists in Georgia Street, Washington, D.C. And, well, I mean, we kind of successfully killed one of them, but unfortunately they set off a bomb which was rather catastrophic, I'd wager, for the rest of the city. No matter, no matter, we're still on the case. Plenty of terrorists left to kill, so... Washington DC destroyed subway. Incoming from Benton. You're lucky to be alive. 10 square blocks of downtown DC just sank 20 feet into the ground. It looks like Roma had the entire subway wired to explode as part of his escape plan. It's likely you've cut off his or you've cut his timetable short and that he's still down there with you. Amarov and Gerdu also remain unaccounted for. But don't let Roma escape that terminal. And be aware that you're now completely cut off from all reinforcements. Yep. Gabe, Things Gabe, are pretty bad. <coughs> I'm here. <laughs> I'm alright. Oh my god, Gabe. I thought you'd been killed. Not yet. Get on the wire and tell Benton that the subway's a decoy. The main bomb is somewhere else. Where's Roma? My video feeds are dead. Last visual had Romer moving towards level one, and Girdu was moving through the main tunnel just beneath the street. The ramps down here have collapsed. I'll have to find another way up. Yeah, uh, this place is pretty hot. <laughs> I can only imagine. Uh, also, this fire, this fire burns, kids. It's hyper, hyper lethal. But we're not going to worry about that too much, because we've got uh, plenty of health and all that good stuff. Now, let's switch up to something a little bit more useful, shall we? Uh, let's take the pistol out for a ride, I suppose. Now, just around this corner, there's an unfortunate gentleman that's on fire. Now, if he grabs us, uh, we are instantly dead. He will literally burn us to death. Also, if we walk over his burning corpse, our bin bag armor... Kind of looks like we're wearing a trash bag. We'll literally disintegrate as well. So you're going to have a bad time. But no worries, man. Gabe is a professional. Come on, sir. Let's be having you. There we go. Not bad. Yeah, they really did a number on this place, didn't they? I remember uh, when I played this originally. Like the, the, the whole feeling of this bit is just intense. But we've got some Tomb Raider... Uh, action coming up. Gabe, the viral bomb you tagged on level one, CBDC can't get to it. Debris is blocking the ramp to the street. Tell them to stand by. I'll find some of Romer's stashed explosives and clear it from my side. Yeah, that's a problem. Luckily, Roma has left some stashed explosives, apparently. Not really sure how uh, we know about that, but we're not going to question things. Anyway, I think it's about time to let the M79 do the talking. Don't you? That gentleman in the corner there is going to literally continuously huck grenades at us. And, well, we know how grenades are in this game. They're a one-hit kill. They are really, really nasty. So good old Gabe reaches into his back pocket and grabs that grenade launcher. Now, the explosives that uh, we want are right here in this, like, hidden... Ah, hello. Quiet your noise, sir. In this hidden little container... Uh, very easy to miss, and I kind of believe back when I was a kid, that be all the I was stuck on that for that quite a while. Anywho, progress is progress. Right, let's carry our rifle with us. Keep it quite tight. So that M79 is amazing at cleaning house. Uh, just be careful you don't uh, dust yourself off at the same time, which I've definitely done more times than I'd like to uh, recount. Isn't that right, Gabe? Yes. Okay. Well, let's make like Lara Croft. Oh, God. Oh, he's rudely interrupted there by that dude. Yep. We do have some kind of light platforming in this game and it's fine for the most part. You do have to be a little bit delicate with it but it's kind of an automatic thing, so, you know. Certainly could have been worse. Also, pushing down on the D-pad gives you a quick turn. I can't remember if I actually mentioned that last time. It's surprisingly useful, 
especially when you hear, you know, grenades clinking behind you. All right, well, we've got our C4. Oh, Leon. Gabe, I've restored video to portions of the undestroyed subway. Romer's men are moving through the main tunnel. I checked the subway map. Where does it lead? This branch feeds into the Washington Park lines. That's it. Tell Jenkins to get his men to the park and exercise extreme caution. Gerdu is there. Gerdu. Benton says he'll handle it. Benton, eh? All right, well, hopefully Benton's going to handle it in a good way. All right, there's the bomb. Remember this place? We were just here. Uh, a little bit less fire last time we were here, though. Now, that's the uh, gate that we need to explode. Good thing we found all this uh, C4. Would have been out of luck otherwise. Um, yeah, about the quick turn that I mentioned. Yep. I I guess I guess the quick turn doesn't always work. How about that? <laughs> okay, so once more we're feeling. Right, the So the quick Okay, maybe the quick turn doesn't work when you're too close to something. Does that make sense? Probably makes sense. Doesn't really make that much sense. So we're not going to rely on that when our life depends on it. CBDC is on their way in. Come on, dude, run! Come on, my uh, my banana brother, I guess. All right, he's going to get to work on that bomb, and we're going to kind of save him. Luckily, he seems to disarm that bomb really quickly. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Whew. Whew. Okay. Alright. Could have been worse. Could have been better. All clear, Gabe. Yeah. All clear indeed. Now, if I was a flak jacket... I certainly wouldn't be around here, probably. Oh, well, whatever. Now, we need to go through here. No, we don't. We need to go back up here and the other side. Actually, I think there is, like, a flak jacket here somewhere. The game is usually somewhat generous, at least to start with, with those flak jackets. But you can see, though, that was a good little demo of just how quick those flank jackets can be dissolved. Well, she hasn't told us about it yet, but... Those are the gas mains. You better shut them off just to be safe. Oh, we actually get a different dialogue there. Yeah, we can turn the gas mains off. Probably a good idea, because there's probably gas burning somewhere in here, and that's probably, definitely, going to be impeding our progress. But that's okay. Good old Gabe. Yeah, if we actually come up this way, she will actually mention shutting off the gas mains. I don't know if we can go up here, actually. Gabe, Romer is in the main tunnel. You can't get to it from here. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Calm down, calm down. But... All right, <laughs> okay. I guess there's no goodies there, actually. All right, I am disappointed. Not upset. Alright, I'm just just disappointed. So this is uh, the bit that is completely and utterly blocked off. Which is why we need to come up here. Ugh, there we go. God damn woman. I'm getting a message from Jenkins. Their team is in the park. They are under attack. One of the terrorists has a flamethrower. Gerdu. Benton wants us a to head flame over there thrower. Staff. Tell them as soon as I take out Romer, I'll be on my way. A flamethrower? Ooh, that's spicy. Wouldn't say no to one of those myself. But, you know. I actually can't remember if we get a flamethrower in this game. Yeah, alright, dude. Alright, calm down. Might not happen. Alright, yeah. It already, already did happen, didn't it? Uh, unlucky. Hopefully, there's no flamethrower wielding dudes coming our way. Oh, yeah. Oh, hi. Excuse me. No, no, no. Quite enough of your nonsense, sir. Logan. Logan. 
I've spotted Mara Aramov in the tunnel. I'm going after her. <laughs> She's having way too much time with herself. Oh, having way too much time with herself? That doesn't even make any sense. She's having way too much fun. By herself, I should say. Right, yeah, we'll, we'll drop a save. Certainly. I only took 10 minutes, that mission. Damn, son. Oh, I suppose we'll do the next one. This next one's actually really, really short. Washington, D.C. main subway line. Incoming from Benton. Logan, Intel indicates that Roma has fled the scene. Jenkins is meeting heavy resistance in the Washington Park area. And DCPD reports 15 officers down. We fear an agency leak has given his permis uh, permission, <laughs> has given his position away. Mara Amarov, identity has been confirmed by Interpol. Do not let her escape. Caution. FEMA is using the eastbound tracks to shuttle emergency personnel. Do not use explosives of any kind in the tunnel or you will cause a derailment. Well, I mean, all right. Yeah, yeah that seems like a bad thing. I don't know what she's finding so funny. She's just, she's like having such an amazing time. Notice our armor uh, and health statistics are carried over. So, you would think this would be trivial to just launch a uh, grenade betwixt her buttocks and uh, have a jolly good time, but sadly that's not, uh, not how it works. All right, let's wait for the next train. Okay, man. And then we're gonna charge. Ooh, nope, that was a little bit too close. Run! Remember your training and you will make it alive. All we have to do is to kill her, by the way. So, what we can do is be a little bit of a sly bugger here. And just headshot her. Mission complete. Where's Romer? Where are the other bombs? You're too late, Logan. We'll see. Yeah. I actually really like the fact that you can just headshot seemingly anybody. Because otherwise, you have a huge section where you've... I think you can chase her for uh, quite a while. And then what will happen eventually, she'll actually like turn around and you'll trap her and you ha can actually fight her. But because she's got a flak jacket on, you're probably going to have a bad time. Now, it's not too bad because, um, you know, headshot. But if you don't know about the headshot tactic, you're going to have a bad time. Anyway, guys, um, I'm going to save this one and cut this one off. We've done two missions, but that's a really short video. I'm going to see how long the next mission is, and I might tack that onto this video. Just because there's no way. Um, now I've cut down on the amount of videos I'm putting out. There's no way I'm doing a 30-minute video. So, um, thank you very much for watching, guys. And I might see you in a second. We do have time to do this one. So, Washington, D.C. Washington Park, incoming from Benton. Mission redirect. CBDC has requested direct intervention and assistance. Your new orders are to locate viral bombs, plant homing beacons, wait for the arrival of CBDC, and provide covering fire. The bombs are set to detonate within the hour. Terrorist resistance is heavy. Agency intel reports that Anton Geru is leading the park operation. Ex Size caution. We have lost all communication from Jenkins' team. Well, that's okay. Gabe Logan I'm on my way to the park. is on I station. Sent a team to pick up Mara Aramov. I left her wounded and unconscious in the Fifth Avenue tunnel, but chances are she's already on the move. Copy. And if he hasn't alerted FEMA, he better do it soon. Romer is going to trigger the main viral device whether or not the government meets his demands. I'm already on it. Did you get any information on their operations in the park? Tell Jenkins the smaller viral bombs are hidden throughout the park. Gertu has the main one. Logan, this is Benton. I have a mission redirect. Jenkins' team has been eliminated. I'm putting you on located recon. Benton, what's going on? The CBDC's getting slaughtered. We need you to track down the viral devices and provide covering fire while CBDC agents come in and disarm them. Copy that. I'll give them cover as long as I can. Leon, how much time till the main device detonates? Less than an hour. Okay, let's do it. 
I've set the pickup frequency for your beacons to nine or four seven. CBDC is standing by. So, looks like our friends have been slaughtered, huh? All right. I suppose it takes a Gabe size tool to fix this issue. Well, we've start off with uh, 20 minutes on this one, and that is way more time than we're going to need. So, let's start getting to work, shall we? Now, visibility is kind of anus here, which is fine. We have plenty of time. Oh god, we're actually being hit and killed by somebody. That's jolly indecent of them. Verticality is like a big thing on this level. There's loads of enemies hiding above us and below. That's not true. They're never below us. But we can dream. Okay, let's have a quick peek at this old map, shall we? So the first bomb is actually coming up pretty soon. There are plenty of flak jackets on this level as well, so... Ah, oh, we also get the 45. Yeah, let's switch up to the 45. This is actually a really, really powerful, decent handgun, to be honest. And one that I probably am going to use quite a bit. Oh. There's the first one. Now, you'll notice these CBD guys get here pretty bloody quick. The old banana squad. Which is nice. No time wasting. And he actually... Bloody hell, he disarmed that bomb in record time. <laughs> They're not all that quick, I promise. Alright, well, that's fine. Good work, Banana Man. Now let's go see if we can rustle up a flat jacket. There are indeed... Ah. Shotgun. Eh, no, okay. We maxed out on shotgun for now. That's fine. Anybody got a flat jacket for little old me? Aye. Excellent. Perfect. One of these trash bag flat jackets. Now, I actually do remember this level quite well just because it has a very unique look to it. You know, with that. Oh, hello. I'm picking up an emergency call from CBDC. They have a hostage situation near the tennis courts. Can you help? Hmm. Hostages, eh? Well, we'll get to that as soon as we can. Let's deal with these bombs first. Yeah, this level has like a very ominous kind of look to it. CBDC has the signal. And the, um, the lack of, a, like, far draw distance actually helps quite a lot. Come on, boys. Now, I don't know how tough these agents are. I'm guessing they could probably take a shot or ten. But let's not jinx that too much. Oh, good God. Come on, sir. Get your medicine. There you go. All clear, Gabe. Two bombs remaining. Wow, our flat jacket took a good chunk of damage there, but that's fine. We can patch that up find another trash bag over here somewhere. So hostages, eh? Well, we can do some sneaking with our new rifle to solve that problem. What we got here? Oh, evening. I thought that guy actually had... Oh, oh, duck. Duck and cover. So we can actually see now that these goons are getting fairly decently accurate. They're not playing around like they did in the first level. I trace the signal from the calm array. They have an uplink dish hidden somewhere in the park. Mm. If you can find it and give me a connection, I can locate their trigger ramp. Sounds like a plan. Alright, Leon, we shall certainly try our best. Now, what have we got going on here? Now, we've got some sneaky sniper guys around here. Luckily, we can just charge them. We can just bum rush them. I'm guessing, although I haven't actually been shot by one of these rifles, I'm guessing they do a terrifying amount of damage being a rifle. It also illustrates just how well equipped these particular terrorists are. 
Ow. Oh, that was close. That was close. That was as close it gets. So we've got like no health left whatsoever. That's fine. The guy's just got his 45. Ooh, sniper on deck. Really? Can you not hit him? Huh. All right. <laughs> I guess not. Yeah. Sometimes the auto aim just doesn't really seem to get up to much, but you know. Let's get our sneak on this time, shall we? Probably a better idea. Now, let's go creep around the woods. Evening sunshine. Now, what would be cool is if we could have some kind of stealth kill. Oh god, something. Okay. That's not how we're stealthy and sneaky. Gabe. Don't know where that guy was hiding. Probably in the darkness behind a tree. That's where they usually are. Alright, that's cool. That's fine. Everybody chill. Okay. I <laughs> don't know how he didn't get alerted, but good lord. Gabe, I thought you was an expert. I mean, honestly. Oh, hello. Evening. You're done, son. Sneak, 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 sneak. There's quite a few goons here, from what I remember. You don't want to risk shooting them anywhere near an iffy hitbox. Of which there are many. Because that was the style of the time. Luckily, ammo for this weapon is plentiful here. Alright, sneak, sneak, sneak. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Ooh, you have a right. Uh, you don't have a rifle. You have a pistol. Oh, no matter. Rifle bullet to the brain sorts your problem out. So I guess if you don't alert these guys, there's no sniper up there. Huh. How about that? Okay, cool. Well, the time for sniping is over. Let's flag up this bomb. Right, let's see what we can do. Here they come, here they come. Now these guys definitely can't take too much punishment. Not as much punishment as I would hope. Now some of these, as you can see, come straight for you and some of them seem more interested in your friends. Which is bad, but that's okay. Alright, it's time to get our sneak on. Grab you. Nope. Grab you. Nope. We don't need none of that. Okay, so there should be one bomb left for expert Gaben here. One left. We can handle that, right? I hope so. Hopefully we can find ourselves another flak jacket as well. Because ours is a little bit worse for wear. Actually, I think there's a flat jacket in here, which, yes, there is. Yeah, they're not going to let us go down without a fight, though. Just the two of them. I heard that, guys. Come on. It's not as sneaky sneak as you thought. Gabe is the sneak master, apparently. You know, when he's not stepping through uh, broken twigs and things. All right, not bad, not bad. So one bomb left and we've still got half of our time. Think we're doing okay. Now, this place crawls. Let's get our rifle back out. Wait, we've been here before, haven't we? Nope, this is all fresh, new. Uncharted territory. It's okay, because we're going to walk softly and... Oh. All 
Alright then. Let's get the 45 out. The 45 seems to be pretty good, actually, at protecting these guys. Alright. You're on your way. We're on our way. Everybody's on their way. Let's just hope we're going somewhere good. Now, I say this thing's not bad at protecting these guys. We were doing a pretty good job at shooting the scenery there. Come on, get it done, son. Get it done. Ah. Where's everybody gone? Bingo? Probably not. Ah, there we go. Gonna say he's getting a bit lonely here with just me and my uh, banana friend. Yeah, all right, all right. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, totally fine. Give me a cutscene so I get locked. Oh, our friend is dead. Give me a cutscene that like locks me into a lamppost. That's fine, game. I see. You're not playing nice, are you? Alright, well, whatever. We've got the bombs done. So, the next objective we have. Ooh, please be a flat jacket. <gasps> yes, nice. Ask and you shall receive. Excellent. Not bad, Gaben. Not bad. Now, this one is a little bit of a nightmare down here. Because they do like throwing enemies at you from the top. She's a little bit sneaky, if you ask me, but... That's okay. We're just ramboing our way through everything. Yeah, I was going to say, another one appears behind us here. You sneaky little bastard. Yes. Can't get past old Gaben that easy, though. Although you did. Come on. You and your bloody infinite... Shotgun. A little bit cheaty, if you ask me. That's okay. I suppose the enemies have to even the odds somehow. Ah, right. This is sneaky, sneaky bit. Sneaky, sneaky bit. Now, this we kind of have to get right. We got it wrong. We got it wrong. That's okay. That was the test warm-up. <laughs> that was our little warm-up round. So, what we want to do here... Let's try and sneak round, because there's two terrorists. Actually, no, there's one terrorist. There he is. And he's holding our friends hostage. Well, that won't do. Leon, tell CBDC Command that I freed the hostages. I'm back on task. I copy. I'll let him know. Alright, not bad. Not bad, Gabe. That certainly could have been worse. Could have been better as well, but... Shh. Shh. It's fine. As our Lord and Saviour once said, doesn't matter whether you win by an inch or a mile, winning is winning. You can quote me on that. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's let's take the 45. Good old reliable 45. And we can roll our way to victory. Which was the style of the time. Alright, let's go mop these guys up. Lovely. There's a few in here. I reckon we probably are. Leon. Oh dear, there's a sniper. There's always a sniper. Destructible lights. You know, that's something that was also very rare back in the day. Destructible lights. I mean, sometimes you could shoot lights out, but the fact that they actually, you know, cast light, in a manner of speaking, is pretty bloody impressive for the time. But then, I know we are playing this on an emulator, and we are using lots of uh, graphics hacks. But it's not an ugly game. 
Definitely Leon. not. Connections complete. I'm tracking a mobile signal just north of you towards the Freedom Memorial in the Hedge Maze area. Mm -hmm. Check Romer's file and see who he's been using as trigger man. I'll bet these bombs are set with a backup mobile detonator. Got it. Jorge Marcos. I'm downloading his dossier into your comp device. Trigger man. Hit list. Trigger man, you say? Right. Going down. Oh god, sketch. One second, guys. Alright, cool. So now we have our target tracked. And we should be heading into the head mage. Head mage? The head mage. The hedge maze. Yes. I do words good sometimes. And other times, I, I do not do words good at all. Dyslexia. All right. So, if I was a trigger man, I would probably be around here somewhere. Just a guess. If we stay on the path, the path actually... Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, you stupid bastard. That's where the main viral bomb is. Tell CBDC to stand by. Yep. That guy is heavily, heavily armoured. With a flak jacket. Which is why you want to try and shoot his face off. Otherwise, you're going to have to, like, chase him around this entire maze. And he does have a set of goons that do periodically, like, appear. I don't know whether they just spawn in or whether they're actually, like, hiding in the, the maze the whole time. I don't know. I guess we shall see. Oh, hello. Good evening. So, what's next? Nothing. Apparently. Oh, there we go. Got him. Now, this bit is a little bit of an ass. We're going to want to use our sneak. Definitely going to want to use our sneak here. Now, also, Antov, or whatever her name was, we left her wounded. No, we didn't. We shot her face off with extreme prejudice. I don't know. What exactly is wounded about that? But hey, what do I know? I guess. I guess terrorists can survive with their faces sh not completely shot off. Right, these guys all have flat jackets. But the good news is. If I can find the weapon. Oh god, the good news is ugh, their faces are still very, very fragile. Which we do appreciate. Where are you? Where are you? There you are, I see. Looking rather lovely in the moonlight there, sir. Oh, hello. Nope. Oh, God. Just about took his cranium out. Right, now, is there one left? Yep, there's one left. Now, we can kind of do this weird little shimmy dance, but I'm not 100% sure how effective that is at keeping enemies off you. Now let's have a quick check around as well. 9mm ammo. Okay. We haven't seen that for a little while. And I'm not going to argue about having that topped up. Because the 9mm, you know, isn't too bad. Now is there any more supplies around here before we move on? There's certainly a 
few things that I'd like. Actually, the 9mm will probably help us out in the start of the next video. Probably quite a lot. Alright, well, I think that's this level pretty much wrapped up. Not bad. A nice little romp through the park. Got some fresh air. Spilt some blood. Saved some lives. I think that's been a pretty productive evening. Really. Wish my job was that productive. I'm at the entrance. Tell CBDC to get their team moving. Hurry, Gabe. You don't have much time. Gaben! And with that, guys, we really are going to end the second video. So, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.